Hey, sweet Mila. It's Uncle Pascal. I love you so, so much. Here's Pepper. Unless you change it, Mila, my prayer will be as it was for your mom, that you will know him and the power of his resurrection in your life, that you will grow to be prettier on the inside than you are on the outside, and that you will wait on your husband who will love you second only to God. I love you so much today. I can't imagine it growing stronger, but I know it will. I'll never forget the moment that you looked at me and told me that you were pregnant with me, Laura. It was a moment that we've been praying for and hoping for for so long. And Mila, I just, I love you so much already and I cannot wait to watch you grow. Thank y'all for sharing your faith and just living it out in a powerful testimony to what it is to wait for the Lord. I love y'all. Love Mary Amelia. Happy birthday, Mila. We are so glad you're here. So glad you're here. I can't wait to come and hold you and play with you. How glad you are. We love you. I just want you to know that we love y'all so much and we can't wait to meet Mila and we are so excited for y'all. We've prayed for this little baby for so many years. We're so bad we could be there, but we'll be thinking about y'all, and Pastor's gonna be updating us every step of the way. We love y'all so much. We know y'all are gonna be the best parents literally in the world. Um, love y'all so much, and we will see y'all as soon as we get home. Bye. Rachel, the first picture that I have of us is at my three-year-old birthday party, and I cannot wait for our friendship to continue through our children. I love you with all my heart, and I'm so excited for you and Dan to share this blessed experience. And Miss Mila, I cannot wait to see how beautiful and gracious you are, baby girl. I love y'all. Hey, Ray Ray and Dan, it's Edna. And Chad. And we just want to say that we love y'all and we're so proud of y'all for standing the test of time with full faith and confidence in the Lord that you're going to have this promised child and we cannot wait to meet her. We know y'all are going to be wonderful parents and blessed is the man who remains steadfast under trial for when he has stood the test, he will receive the crown of life which God has promised to those who love him. That's James 1.12 and we know that that uh, y'all believe in God's promises and it shows in the way you live your life. We love you and love God you. bless you. Frank and I are so excited and we're thinking of you all night and we can't wait to hear the news in the morning. And we're sending you all our best love. And I join in that, Rachel. Be sure to let us know as soon as you can how things are going. Sweet, sweet Mila Birch, how excited we all are to have you join our family. You are already blessed by two God-fearing parents who will guide and direct your path. Fun times are ahead and I plan on spoiling you rotten. It's going to be an incredible journey watching you and Grace grow as cousins and friends. Now you can call me Apple and let's go creaking real soon. Rachel and Dan, this is Erica. I am so glad this world has another piece of you in it. And Mila, we've been waiting on you, baby. Hey, sweet Mila, this is your cousin Eleanor sending you all my love. Can I wait 
simplicity to you sweet little girl and just be a part of your life and love you. a kiss from Gardner. We love you, baby Mila. Hey, Mila. This is your grandmother, Cece. We're so glad you're here. We've been waiting for you for a long time. Love you. Rachel and Dan, congratulations. I'm so happy you finally experienced a love you never knew was possible. Y'all are going to be awesome at parenthood. We love y'all so much. Jay and Chad. Y'all are a perfect picture of God's faithfulness. And that is exactly what Mila Birch is. And I can't wait to meet her and love her and spoil her and pray for her for the rest of my life. I love you all so much. Welcome the newest member to our Arkansas clan. So excited to see her and hold her and have her become part of the Arkansas traditions that we all so love. Hey Mila, it's your granddaddy, Big D. I'm just uh, so glad you're here. Won't you know how much your mom and daddy have worked and how hard they work to, to bring you into this world and how much they love you. And no matter what you think later in life, you just remember that everything they do, they do out of love. And no matter how, how mad you get at them, there's a purpose. And I know they're gonna raise you right and have you, you'll have a relationship with the Lord. And that's all you can ask for. I love you. <laughs> 